What's going on guys, Adamclis here, and today we just got some brand new information about the new mobile patch that is dropping tomorrow, and I want to just go over all of it with you, give you my thoughts, and uh, get your thoughts as well. So uh, let's just take a look at it, shall we? As always, remember to hit the subscribe button, like, and comment down below, because it would mean the world to me, and slam that notification bell. Uh, but first, let's check out this new video that they just dropped. Sorry if the quality is a little bit off, but the Twitter video is a little off. So battle continues. All right. This looks, I mean, this is all the same stuff. Ooh, Sylveon. More customization. Okay. All right, Charizard. We got a couple of those already. Oh, the Space Gengar though, baby. I'll take that one to the bank. That's nice. Sylveon. Oh my gosh. Please tell me they're dropping Sylveon tomorrow. Or Mam and Mammoth Swine. Please tell me they're dropping them tomorrow. Need it so badly. So badly. More ways to play. Oh, mobile. Create Unite Squad. Oh, is this like a team? Like a like a clan? It is. Interesting. Crossplay enabled. Crossplay is gonna be rough. Play it on everything tomorrow. Wow, very interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay, so they also went and uh, made a new blog post. So let's check that out. Message from the Unite team. This is the release of... Uh, let me just zoom in here a little, little bit. Zoom in here, Tad. Okay, cool. Um, since the release of Pokemon Unite on the Switch, the team has read about all the topics, yada, yada, yada. Details, strategies... Every piece of feedback has been valuable, yada, yada, yada. Okay, for both new and returning players, we're thrilled to share some gameplay updates that tomorrow also brings. So this should be coming tomorrow. Full cross-platform play and account linking across mobile devices and Nintendo Switch. Link a new account, play with the same account across both platforms. Cool. New in-game events in which you can get super item enhancers that can upgrade a held item to grade 30. So maybe this is their way of evening out that pay-to-win um you know, complaint that people have where you can get a super item enhancer and just automatically boost it to 30. New held items to introduce fresh strategies. Thank God we definitely need some of those, but also they kind of need this initial thing because otherwise people are going to be pissed that they have to spend even more money. Introduction of Unite Squads, allowing trainers to team up with squad mates. We already saw that. That looks like clans or something. Uh, second battle pass, new cosmetics. Okay, I don't really care too much for the cosmetics, to be honest. Limited spectator mode features. That was a really nice thing when they were testing it and support for multiple new languages. Okay. I really am hoping that later on today they go and they show us some actual, uh, you know, the balance changes that should be coming with this patch. I'm hoping. Um, it doesn't look like it says, you know, new Pokemon are coming tomorrow, which is a little bit of a downer. Uh, we'll continue to add more playable Pokemon, make balance adjustments to Pokemon and maps. Trainers can anticipate, you know, new content, developing a new mode of play designed to level the playing field for all trainers, regardless of their held item grades. I like that idea. I definitely like that idea. Dedicate me unite as fun as engaging as possible. Change above represent many ways we're headed towards that goal. Please just fix the matchmaking for the love of all that is good and holy. So we've got full cross-platform play. We know that's coming out tomorrow. Um, I will. I don't know if I'll be switching to mobile. I really don't want to play the game on mobile, but mobile will have a distinct advantage over Nintendo Switch, I'm telling you right now. So be prepared for that. I'm curious to see if they're going to reset ranks for tomorrow. I don't know. Um, I'm really excited for new held items uh, because I'm hoping that they have a held item that allows you to bust down shields. That would change up the game significantly, you know, and there's also going to, I guarantee there's going to be some held items that maybe help out some struggling characters, you know, like some of those caster type characters like a Pikachu. Squads. I wonder how many squads you can actually be a part of. If I should make my own. You guys let me know down below. Should I make my own so everybody can hop in? New battle pass. That was expected, but I'm really just excited. I want, you guys know what, you guys know the deal. I talked about it in my, like, this is killing Pokemon Unite video. I want to see... I want, I want to see better matchmaking, actually good ranked, you know, because so much of this is hinging on that stuff, the foundational stuff. 
It's cool if we get cosmetics and it's cool if we get new Pokemon and all that stuff. But if every single game is just going to be the same as how it has been, tomorrow is going to be an absolute nightmare with the influx of new players and with the added addition of the chasm between Nintendo Switch and, you know, and mobile play. So I don't know. I'm I'm really excited for tomorrow. I love that go that that uh, astronaut Gengar skin. But let me know what you guys think down below, and make sure you hit the like button. Go and hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell because you know I love you. And if you have any questions, suggestions, or anything like that, and you want to talk to me about, hop in the Discord. Or you know, if you want any awesome Pokemon merch, head over to the merch land link in the description and uh, go and grab yourself some. Uh, but that's it for me, guys. Damocles out.